Unfortunately, the environment is now considered one of the uh, enemies environment when it comes to journalistic work. Uh, the media sources that I use, uh, I use f almost every media sources, but I don't trust any media. أنا أرى أن الإعلام الدولي يهمل اليمن لأنها هناك اهتمامات مثل سوريا مثلا مثل الأزمة في الخليج الأزمة مع إيران. Media values or media professional is very weak in that country. How can you you expect from anyone or from any journalist to bring a truth while he don't have any food to feed his children? Yemen is a country at war. Like many other Arab countries, Yemen experienced mass protests in 2011 in the context of the so-called Arab Spring, which led to the resignation of longtime president Ali Abdale Saleh, who was succeeded by Abdrabu Mansour Hadi. However, in the aftermath of the Arab Spring, Yemen experienced a grave destabilization. The Houthi movement, which was based in the northern Saudi Shia-dominated provinces of Yemen, advanced from its northern heartland of Sada'a province and ultimately seized the capital of Yemen, Sana'a, in 2014. Fearing a further expansion of the Shia-dominated Houthi movement, Saudi Arabia and eight other majority Sunni Muslim countries launched a military campaign on Houthi-controlled provinces, including airstrikes, a ground offensive, and a naval blockade. At the same time, jihadist military groups in Yemen strived. The war has had a devastating effect on the country with numerous civilian deaths, as well as the destruction of civilian and health infrastructure, and has left 17 of the 27 million Yemeni citizens food insecure, with 500,000 children at risk of death by starvation. The Yemeni conflict has also had an effect on its respective media landscape. While the Arab Spring and the emergence of a plurality of political groups brought about a thriving in Yemen's media landscape, media outlets were soon used as a means to impose political ideologies and attack opponents.